On your marks. Get set. Go. Yeah, while it's fun to collect cars, keep them in the packages, they don't race very well. Here we have the 1996 first edition of the Radio Flyer Wagon. I have people asking, what is a fantasy car? Because for jammers and racing, I only do fantasy models, okay? Fantasy cars. Well, this Radio Flyer Wagon, you might think, well, that's a fantasy car. You won't see that on the road. It's not a real car. Actually, Radio Flyer, that's a real wagon. <laughs> that's a, a real toy. So Mattel has to pay a license to those people in order to make this car. So technically, this is a licensed model, but for fun, we'll go ahead and uh, we'll go ahead and let it race today. But I got to put it up against something else, and you already seen it: Oscar Mayer Wienermobile. You you've definitely seen this one. Well, maybe you have. Maybe maybe you only seen pictures, but uh, Oscar Mayer. They actually have this. They actually have this vehicle driving on the road. They uh, take it for tours and whatnot. It's, it is pretty cool to see it in person. <laughs> it, is, it is really awesome. But once again, uh, while you might think it's a fantasy car, uh, technically it is a licensed model. On your marks, get set, go. Go. Even though it's a hot dog, I really thought that Radio Flyer Wagon was going to win. I'll explain why after this race. Say go! Say go! Say go! Radio Flyer Wagon was the winner. And here is your Oscar Mayer Wienermobile. And this is why this car, I thought this one had an advantage. If you notice when it's in the lane, it, has a, it doesn't have a whole lot of wiggle room, not a lot of room to bounce around, but check out Oscar Mayer Wienermobile. It's, look, I could put my whole finger on this side. It has a lot of room for this to go wee, 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 any bouncing around, and that's gonna slow it down. All right, let me pick some more cars out of my jammers. Here we go, here's my plastic containers. These are called jammers. Well, they used to be called jammers. If you want more information, you can find it in the description along with this video. I'm going to pick a model that starts with D. I've already done Dune It Up, so I'm not going to pick that one again. Hey, that's Dragon Tail. Check it out, Dragon Tail. It's like a little insect. Dragon Tail. Dragon Blaster. Nope, that's not Dragon Blaster. These are all Dragon Tail. i got three different colors of Dragon Tail. This one's Dragon Tail. This one's Dragon Blaster. It's like a... Uh, Dragon with wings. Pretty cool. I like that model. Again, uh, Dune It Up. But we're going to pick a model of Diora. This Diora 2, actually. This is the original Diora. It's low and sleek like this. Now, it doesn't always come with surfboards. You see this one has surfboards. It's not always released with surfboards. But we're going to pick uh, Diora 2. And surfboards, 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 surfboards. And see, like I said, this one right here. Doesn't always, it's not always released with surfboards. As a matter of fact, I don't think Mattel releases it with surfboards anymore. Oh, well, they might change their mind. But let's go ahead and let's go ahead and pick this nice blue and orange color. I'm gonna pick a model that starts with the letter M, not Monoposto. I'm pretty sure I raced that one already. Here's three samples of mini truck. We are gonna get uh, Mad Manga, Mad Manga. This is, uh, I'm not, uh, big fan of Mad Manga for the track. It has this big thing that sticks out. So it won't do loops. And you know what? It won't even do curves either. This part right here gets stuck in the curves. But we could go ahead and do some downhill racing with Mad Manga. This uh, Batman version is my favorite. And while I'm in the M's, I gotta, I gotta take this one out as well. I'm gonna pick an N. Here we have Nerve Hammer. I think Nerve Hammer was in game. It wasn't a Nerve Hammer in video games. I'm pretty sure that was a featured car. Here I have No Matter What. It's like a uh, 
funny looking nomad is what it is this is another uh, pirate model that was in uh, a pirate series that mattel did oh the end model we're gonna pick it's this one right here that's because uh guess what night burner we're gonna go ahead and get night burner here you have night burner but you know what night the reason why i had to get that uh, other night burner or this one out of that pack out of that last jammer is because night burner is actually the new name it, it used to be called mega thrust and now they change it to night burner same model as you can tell not only that this this model here it has a rare place in hot wheels history uh, it was called mega thrust it got to be a treasure hunt when it was in mega thrust uh, when it was uh, yeah mega thrust and then night burner it got to be a treasure hunt again you can see the circle flame logo right there not only that this was a basic treasure hunt during that period uh, they would have the cars be uh, super treasure hunts you see how they had the uh, dollar sign for the s that was this this one and this s right here too super treasure hunt and you see the regular version doesn't have the dollar sign so this was still a treasure hunt but that was the basic treasure hunt here is the super treasure hunt mega thrust and back at this another problem during this time it's hard to see but uh yeah this year they had a bad bad problem with the paint some of the paint speckles i don't know if you can see it in the package there's some there's some speckling in the back As a matter of fact you can see the speckling the paint just flaking off right there well i am not racing my super treasure hunt and i'm going to keep this one in the package as well here's that basic treasure hunt uh, on the package I'll, i have that one opened up i'll go ahead and get this one we'll race the uh, basic treasure hunt version of night burner and here's another couple samples do you like rally cat well if you do you've been pretty lucky this year really quickly they already had four different colors this one is orange and of course you can see the white i like to pick different colors for when they're going down the track so we'll pick the green sample for this one i'm going to grab a couple models that start with the letter t first i'm going to open up track manga i have not opened it up yet track manga it's kind of a sister or companion piece to mad manga pretty cool so i'll be opening up this one this one has a roof track manga has a convertible it's a convertible so we'll be racing this one today and i need another t model not t bucket as much as i love the t bucket when i first started collecting a look in the back twin mill three hey we're not we're talking about t bucket hey, oh there's another twin mill three hi oh well t bucket was one of the models where i decided i want every color and every variation and i went to a certain point i i probably have all of them but if they release another one i might pick it up i might not just depends on the color if i like it or not to round out my six racers for today let's go ahead and get a uh, turbot turbot another car four colors right away here you have a nice blue this one's kind of a burnt orange color this one's purple and yellow let's go ahead and grab the yellow one that one will be pretty easy to see compared to the others there you go i have a purple yellow pewter blue green and red up first let's race diora 2 versus night burner diora 2 is going to be in lane two get it diora 2 well, we'll switch lanes, so it's not going to be lane two all the time. Nightburner is going to be lane five. And if you didn't know, Nightburner, it has a turbine in the middle right there. When you blow on the back right there, when you blow on that part, you can get those uh, turbine propellers to spin inside. Here we go. Set, go. Set, go. Go. Diora 2 sure is pretty. I don't recall it winning any races though, and I've used quite a few. Say go! Say go! D 
Dioro 2 makes it a race, but nope, Nightburner. Nightburner won that one. Now I'm gonna race Mad Manga against Track Manga. There's the lane assignments. Set, go! Go! Look at Mad Manga, go! I thought I might slow down when this rubs right here in the transition from the accelerator ramp to the straightaway. Actually, it might, it might not even touch. This one might be a blowout. I totally did not expect that result. Mad Manga joins the winner circle. Ain't no circle. They won its race. And last up, it's Rally Cat vs. Turbot. Did you know that Turbot has an opening hood? Yeah, look, we can open it up. Pretty cool, huh? Are you ready? Are you marks? Get set. Go. Go. Wow, that was a super close race with Turbot getting the first victory. Is Rally Cat going to rally from behind to tie it up? Turbot gets to join this trio and Rally Cat's back here. But we'll go ahead and we'll go ahead and race all six again. Uh, what happened to the other two cars that I raced? Oh, the Trick Tracks Android got them. Hey, let them go. I'm gonna race them again. But first, let's race all six of the cars, and then we'll get the three fastest to race those first two. Set, go. I did it again. I gotta remember to pull this straight back. If I don't pull it straight back, it gets caught. Same lanes. Re-race. Go. Go. Let's get one more car to advance. Say go. Say go. Turbot's going to join the finale. I'm looking for one more car to join the finale. Who's it going to be? It's Mega Thrust. Oh, I mean Nightburner. Got a new name, Nightburner. All right, we're gonna race these five. I don't know if the old school cars have a chance. We'll find out. Sit, go. Sit, go. Oh, the radio flyer wagon made a race of it, but Mad Manga gets first. Hey, look at that. We got three red models and one yellow model in Turbot. Well, the Wienermobile. It has a yellow stripe. Set, go. Set, go. Surprise, surprise, Radio Flyer Wagon, second place. I hope you're enjoying watching the races. Set, go. Go! Go! Wowee! I would have never guessed that these three models would have been the top three. I wouldn't even have guessed that any of these three cars would have been in the top three. They take me by surprise. Thank you for watching. Don't forget, you can post up a pairing or you can even post a single car as a suggestion. Thank you for watching. Have fun with your toys. Bye-bye.